Easiest way to get faster right now. What chances does privateer have? What do you say to a factory ride? How is that for a clickbaity intro? <laughs> but it's not clickbait because it is 1000% good advice. And it's unorthodox because most people say, hey, it's got to happen in the gym. Hey, you got to spend more time on the bike. Well, you know what? Sometimes people don't have the resources to ride every day, to work out every day, the equipment, the people around them, okay? So what you really need to focus on, on the biggest tip to get faster now is mental fortitude. It's reading, 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 reading. Yes, you heard me, reading right? This sport is incredibly mental. Yes, physical dominance can make you great, but mental dominance can make you unstoppable. And yes, that is a quote from <laughs> Relentless, which is a, a fabulous book that I will link in the description. I'll have some books that I think help in this sort of situation. And it's something that I wish I did more while I was writing in my adolescence, because you need to keep your mind sharp. It's not just your body. We spend so much time focusing on, you know, nutrition and riding. And, you know, a lot of people work on the mo their motorcycle. They beef it up with big bores or whatnot, put a pipe in it, you know, put a new top end in it, new clutch, new tires, make it all pretty, nice little hot sheen shine type stuff. I don't even know if that's really <laughs> hot sheen shine. <laughs> but you get my point is there's a lot of effort focused on the physical aspect and the actual equipment, but it's not focused on where you are emotionally and mentally. And therefore, people need to read more. Sometimes the weather, you can't just go outside. And everyone thinks that school is optional, especially in this sport, is, is a lot of the people that are at the top right now, they were homeschooled. Not saying that there's anything wrong with being homeschooled. However, even the kids that get out of high school, right, or you know, maybe decide to go to college or not go to college, after they graduate, it's, and there's a quote that says that, you know, the mind dies either at 25 or later on in life. You know, it, it's essentially stating that the learning doesn't stop there. You need to keep your mindset fresh and it's by reading. So The Art of War, that is a fabulous book to read. It's a quick read. It's like 80 pages. So anybody that is racing motorcycles, that is some damn good information. Who, not how. It's a business book, but it's telling people finding help as opposed to just trying to do it all by yourself is great, right? If you're struggling with just hope, here's a good book on hope. And there's so many psychological books about therapy, about writing, about performance. And I'm, I'm hitting you with another quote. People cannot change when they don't know. But once you do know, you cannot help but change. Meaning, why go through all of the struggle by trying to figure out yourself when you could just sit on, as opposed to playing video games or finish a Netflix show, you could read a book and you'll know, you'll know. And it, it, most people are going to say this is silly advice, but I'm, I guarantee you that is the number one way to get faster right now. Few people will do it. Those who will, I commend you. This is Johnny F. and Hopper. Until next time, keep it WFO and go pick up a freaking book. Bra da 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 da. Oh.